Beyonce just dropped her country album. What's it called? Cowboy Carter. Okay. Are you listening to the album? Or are you going to give it a chance, Alexa? <laughs> I'll give it a chance. You just give it a chance. Yeah, I'll give it a chance. Okay. Why would you give something it a chance? Something different. Okay. Something different. New Beyonce. <laughs> okay, New Beyonce. Okay. Something different. Yeah, I'll give it a chance. Have you heard sure. any of the music? Um, no, no, no. No, not you yet, haven't. Not okay, yet. okay. But so I'll check it out. You check it out, <laughs> Mark. How are you feeling with it? Man, I heard that. Uh, what's the <laughs> single called? Uh, she got um Texas Hold'em, Texas Hold'em and she got yeah. sixteen uh, candles or something like that. Texas Hold'em is a the a flip on the Franklin song, right? Yeah, it bro. is. Like I don't know, man. It's it seemed kind of corny and like a cash grab to me. But I mean, she could do what she wants. She Beyonce, but um, it's not for me. Tell me about this corny cash grab. I want to hear about more about that. Tell it, me why you feel like it that. J it just feels like everybody's trying to do the play that uh, Lil Nas X did, which is okay. Like, I feel like Lil Nas is like an industry plant in the sense that um, they set that up for him, the whole um, Old Town Road thing. Yes. And then they got a, what, what's, what's the dude's name that was on the song? Miley Cyrus. Uh, Miley Cyrus, yeah, yeah, yeah. Billy, yeah. Ray? Billy, Billy Ray Cyrus, yeah. Like, like an independent artist is just going to be able to pull him out of nowhere? Come on. This is this is true. So the industry, have you heard about an industry plant? Yeah, I Okay, have. so anybody else you think is an industry plant, like, like a Nav, for example. I think he's an industry plant Ooh. myself. Nav. Nav. Yeah. Oh, Nav. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he's an industry plant myself. Yeah. It's uh, just crazy how these artists. Is is he an industry plant or he just he knew Drake? I don't know his his uh, backstory like that. It, it just feels like he just came out of nowhere and he just got big. I'm not saying he didn't grind. I'm just saying. I, I feel, feel like when you're associated with Drake, you just get big. Yeah. Like nobody. I mean, anybody could be around Drake and just get just blow up. That's true. Okay. What yeah. about four bats? Yeah, that's probably an industry plan. You sure. think that's an industry plan? Yeah. Okay. I think Tyla, or T the new um, girl, I think she just... You I think, think she's an industry yeah, plan? The one she, from Africa? Yeah. Uh, she has the the wetter, water. She has the water, water song. Okay. yeah. I that's interesting. Should. I don't know. Industry plan. Okay. Are we going to have to title this industry plans for YouTube? Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> no, no. This is this is, this is why we got y'all in here. I want these opinions or whatever to go. So, as far as um, Beyonce's record, it is like 27 songs. That's very long. It's gonna probably take people a month to listen to the whole album. So, do you feel like she will be accepted in the country music world? No, I don't think so. Okay, why not? There's already a lot of um, controversy with that because people from like Texas or actual country people are going against that. Is it true? It's is something, true? I don't know. I think it's also, yeah, it's just the hype. <laughs> you think it's hype? Yeah. You think, they, hype. you think country music fans are just not gonna embrace it? Um, yeah, I think some will give it a chance, but other than that, I feel like people are not. Okay, and Mark Four, how are you feeling? I see it for what it is, man. Like, I see hip hop as a whole, and okay. just uh, urban music is going down, streaming numbers in general are going down. So, what is Beyonce the queen of R&B doing? She's throwing a net, so whoever she catches, she's trying to bring. I in. like that exactly. Um, she's doing more songs because, like I said, people are streaming less, and in order to get more money gonna need more records on the track so there you go that's what it seemed like to so me. he just broke down right there for yeah. everyone that's understanding streaming you know the least streams that you have it's kind of like a kanye west album he's like a 28 30 song something crazy why so long for the streaming people will click to at least hear a little bit of the song mm -hmm. that's gonna pay you mm -hmm. i wish the streaming world had some type of situation like the movie industry where they pay royalties a lot better you know mm -hmm. it, you have to pay so many millions of streams before you get any money well, it depend. It all depends who your DSP is too. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Um, what you're doing as far as like your ASCAP and everything. Yeah. I mean, if you're producing the stuff too, then you get paid two times. So That's it's right. cool. But I think the best way to actually get money off of music nowadays is direct to consumer. And it's kind of crazy that Beyonce and Jay Z just haven't invented that. I know that, like Jay had title, but then he sold it to he white folks. He sold it to title, yeah. He sold it to white folks. He sold it to title. He did, he did. Yeah. yeah, he was all like, hey, support a black man, this and that, sold it to white folks. But He's, yeah. after that, I, I feel like uh, directed consumer is the way to go. Okay. Like as far as uh, making your money because you could sell like, let's say you sell 10,000 in UJ. I mean, like do the numbers, you know what I'm saying? This is crazy and very true. Uh, so uh, for me, I think that uh, Beyonce, I think that she will be nominated for Grammy Country. I think that's going to happen. I, I know it's a stretch. I just feel that she's going to do so much to bring so many new people into country that if they like Beyonce's country music, they'll listen to other artists as well. You know, there's so many country music uh, artists out there that, that are really good. You think she's going to get a Grammy for real? I think so. Can I jump in real quick? Yeah, you got to get on the mic, though. got to get on the mic. 
Okay. So I need to know it's on the mic. I think she's gonna do well with the country album when she's got <laughs> the country grassroots because originally she's from Texas. She, okay. I feel like she has more of a voice for country music. Um, you I think was, so? I wasn't a fan of Jolene though. I know. It, I feel like it didn't come from the the soul. The soul, yeah. Like Dolly Parton. I felt like she was just speaking it. But okay. I think she did a smart thing by bringing in country artists to sing or intro some of the songs because that's going to pull in people who are skeptical about her listen, um, singing country. True. So I think bringing in Dolly, Miley, and Willie Nelson and a bunch of new um, rising black artists that are c in country music right. is what's going to help her. Um, I also think it's gonna. Is she gonna win the award as well? I think she'll be nominated. I don't know. Yeah, she'll, I, think I don't think she'll. she'll be I don't think she'll win it though. You don't think she'll win? Nah, because nah. like look at what Jay did at the Grammys uh, recently. Oh, right? he, it's a play. He set it up. Yeah. Uh, it seemed like more or less like he was uh, complaining. Yeah. Yeah. So, I agree. Yeah. yeah. What he said, some of y'all don't even deserve to be here. Yeah, he's all y'all. <laughs> y'all don't even gotta clap at everything. <laughs> and, and I don't think a lot, some of the songs. I haven't listened to the whole album. Just some. I think. Okay. There's nothing in there that so far has made me go, "Wow, this is like speaking to me. This deserves." A Your country from the from the. I listen she to listened to everything. Yeah. A lot of a lot of country. Okay. Yeah, but I think she does a smart thing too by putting Post Malone on there because that's yeah. gonna bring in people that listen to his music as well i could see post malone getting a grammy for a country right. album before her yes. yeah i agree with that post malone has he's also done it before you know yes, he's, he's, he's been working already he's already in his roots with right. it. right and he's yeah. collaborating with morgan wallen which they're dropping a new song and heavy hitter comb so i i agree with mark he's gonna get something i think before her in country post oh. is out of here bro <laughs> post does it all you yeah, know post yeah. malone right yeah i know Post. Malone. you like post malone's music yeah of course what about the country side of post malone i haven't heard any of you the haven't country heard any? Oh, i'll spam you with a bunch of stuff yeah. okay yeah send <laughs> me the just, good stuff <laughs> he's just a good singer bro. right yeah, like he can when do it he first all. came in with white iversons i was kind of <laughs> skeptical but then because like they were labeling labeling him as hip-hop but then i understood what it was yeah, yeah. And we could even go into him being a planner or whatever, but he's talented as hell, bro. Yeah, yeah, he's really talented. He's there's, talented. there's a lot of songs that he writes that, you know, he's, we have some stuff on him, too. He's dope, bro. Yeah. Like, I, I think he does well no matter what he sings. Yeah, you yeah. feel the passion in his yeah. voice. Okay. you don't feel a lot of people, you don't feel their passion when they sing. Right, because I can close my eyes whenever I listen to him sing, and it lifts me up to a different place. Like Okay, I got a question. Good. So... So basically, uh, Beyonce, she says that she did the album because she wanted to be accepted and have other artists be accepted for just not just making Mark Ford is a rapper, but maybe he wants to do pop music. Right. Right. Will the pop world accept him is kind of how she created this this album for country. Do you think that this is going to spark other artists to get out of their comfortable lane and get to other music? Alexa, how do you feel? Um. <laughs> but do, do you think that artists that do rap or hip-hop you think they'll move into other lanes to do other oh, music yeah. because of this of course yeah i think right now i don't know but in my opinion i think that um what people are trying to do is like okay this isn't let's do something different right to mix it up and okay. be talked about sure be more out there and then of course people are trying to get into different industries of um genres of music and um I, I, I don't know. I think it's just trends right now okay. that people are trying to follow to just keep succeeding and making it fresh. Mark, are you going to do like an R&B album? Uh, you know, I have done it before. <laughs> you got an R&B album? Yeah, I'll send okay. it to you. I um, think we, uh, well, not even an R&B. &B. Not even an R&B album, but an album where I'm taking more risks with like auto-tune and singing and stuff. Like okay. That. So I've done that before. Okay. But I feel like, what was your initial question again? Because I want to answer. Well, my initial question was Beyonce, she put out the country album because she felt like she was held back when she, I think she tried to start this a while back and she wasn't accepted. So this is something that she's been working on for many years now, yeah. right? Do you think that this is going to open up the door for other artists that may want to try different genres of music to be accepted because of Beyonce coming out first with this i feel like maybe as a byproduct like people like she like uh she said alexa saying yeah alexa saying um this is like a industry of trends right now right everybody's copying everybody but what i really think is that this is a play just to 
capture more fans because like i said i believe streaming is going downhill i believe not only rap but like all forms of music the way it's just accessible everybody could do it right now going down here i don't know if you've seen the ai apps that are mm -hmm. allowing people to uh take people's voice and pretty much make a song just by typing something in like t-pain uh teamed up with youtube with a bunch of different other artists and you just able to type in what the song is and it puts together the lyrics it sings it as t-pain and makes the beat that's crazy yeah when i saw that i'm that's like scary too you could that you could use that to your advantage but in the sense of just overall music like music as we knew it is dead yeah wow right. and and even yeah. video like um i do video videography stuff too yeah and, of course um i don't know if you've seen the stuff that uh sora has been doing with open ai i haven't seen it you haven't seen it no you've seen it yeah okay it's, it's crazy all right so pretty much you just type in what you want and it looks like an actual movie straight up like it, AI produces the movie mm -hmm. like real life quality. It's crazy, but <laughs> I you're, know. Gonna, you're gonna be this place. Bl hey man, where am I? I'm, where, what I, world am I, I on right now? I went from like not, I'm like I would never use AI, but I use AI on my on a daily basis. I, I, I use it the text version all the time. Yeah, of the, course. Here's the thing: everybody's gonna use it, and I feel like what's gonna end up happening with the music industry, the movie industry is you're going to get rid of the middleman, right. like which is kind of what social media did as yeah. far as like A&Rs and the people in between. You're pretty much just going to have people creating content and it's going to go straight to the distribution centers like uh, Warner and whoever else. Wow. Yeah. It's gonna, basically going to eliminate um, jobs in exactly. all the entertainment industry. Well, yeah. it's going to reallocate yeah. jobs because yeah. there's going to be people that are going to have to do the prompting and stuff. So it's not yeah. going to be the same jobs that you want, but I mean... It's crazy, bro. Hey, this like, is perfect. Yeah. I, this is this yeah. one topic went crazy, and this is exactly what I got y'all <laughs> here. We're going to take a quick break and come right back with some more music.